Great. How are you doing? Mm, I feel good today. <laughs> Great. So I, my name is Samid and um, mm. I am living in Russia right now, but I am from Pakistan. Mm. Mm -hmm. And I like to cook. I like to keep my room clean and um, I'm also studying here. Mm -hmm. uh, arts and culture management. Okay. And also, I'm a visual artist, a photographer, and a filmmaker. Oh, wow. <laughs> so, if you like, after this class, you can visit my website. You can see and you can... Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm. So, how about you? Okay, my name is Yuko. And I live in Sapporo, Hokkaido. So, yeah. Spelling? What is the spelling? S A P P O R O. Sapporo, Hokkaido. It's in the northern part of Japan, so we have a lot of snow now. Sapporo, let me Google it. S A W P O R O. Ah, city in Hokkaido. All right. Okay, how far is it from Tokyo? Okay, you, it takes about one hour and a half by airplane. It's not that far, yeah. Mm. Nice, and let me see the weather. <laughs> Minus weather. two, oh my god. <laughs> yeah, right, right. It's n actually, it's not cold, minus two. Yeah, 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 yeah exactly. It, mm, mm. If you s Google the weather of Saint Petersburg, where I am right now, we have minus two, two. <laughs> <laughs> Same weather. Yes. Oh, which part of Russia do you live in now? Saint Petersburg. Oh, Saint Petersburg. Ah, so the western part of Russia. Yeah, I don't know what is west and east and whatever. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, so it is minus two and not cold mm. otherwise i have seen minus 27 mm. so that is more cold okay well wow, st petersburg mm. and what do you do i work at a uh, university as an admin staff for over 10 years yeah uh, which university uh, i think you mean you may not know it's my school name is hokkaido university of science Okay. Mm. I think Hokkaido University is the most popular one. They have no no arts faculty, arts? It's about engineering, uh, hmm. healthcare, uh, pharmacy, and media and arts. Yeah. And are there any foreigner, foreign students? Only five foreign students. Are they paying the fee or they are studying foreign scholarships? Uh, one is uh, paid from the government, but other people are by themselves. Great, great. Because I am mm. studying in Russia and I am on government scholarship. Mm -hmm. Great. Nice to hear that. And uh, yeah. so do you want to like go through the vocabulary also or you want to skip this and let's move further? Okay, so yeah, Let, let's do vocabulary first. Okay, great. Mm. So the first word is meme. Meme. We spend the entire lunch break looking at memes. We spend the entire lunch break looking at memes. Establish. Establish. The marine reserve surrounding the poor Knights Island was established in 1981. The marine reserve surrounding the Four Knights Islands was established in 1981. Simplify. Simplify. We performed a simplified version of Hamlet for the school play. We performed a simplified version of Hamlet for the school play. Mm -hmm. Standardize. Standardize. 
standardized testing only tells you so much about a student's ability. Standardized testing only tells you so much about a student's ability. Stick. Stick. His friends started calling him Buddy when he was a kid and the name stuck. His friends started calling him Buddy when he was a kid and the name stuck. Adopt. Adopt. Fax machines were widely adopted in Japan in the 1970s and are still very popular to this day. Fax machines were widely adopted in Japan in the 1970s and are still very popular to this day. Great. Why do British people write color with a U while Americans write color without it? And why does <gasps> traveled have two L's in the UK but traveled just uh, has just one L in America? Why do British people write color with a U, while Americans write color without it? And why does Torbert have two L's in the UK, but Torbert has just one L in America? Mm -hmm. A Facebook meme first shared in 2018 claimed to have the answer. It said American newspaper ads used to car charge by the letter, so advertisers would remove letters to save money. A Facebook meme first shared in 2018 claimed to have the answer. It said American newspaper ads used to charge by the letter, so advertisers would remove letters to save money. Mm -hmm. But according to the fact checkers at Snopes, there is no evidence US newspapers ever charged advertisers by the letter. But according to the fact checkers at Snopes, there's no evidence U.S. newspaper ever charged advertisers by the letter. The earliest American newspapers charged ads by how much space they used and later by the number of lines or the number of words, not by not the number of letters. The earliest American newspapers charged ads by how much space they used and later by the number of lines or the number of words, not the number of letters. And I have one question here. What does Snopes mean? It's uh, maybe a newspaper or maybe a... Yeah, I've, I, I mm. thought it's... Um, you know, you know mm -hmm. yellow, yellow pages? Uh, that shows address and phone numbers? Yes. Oh, okay. So it's like a reference I... checking thing. Snoops, mm. it's a website. Mm -hmm. Snoops is a website. Oh, okay. The truth is that US spelling is different because of one man, Noah Webster, who wrote and published the first American dictionary in 1806. The truth is that U.S. Spring is different because of one man, Noah Webster, who wrote and published the first American Dictionary in 1806. Webster wanted to create an American version of written English that was separated, separate from the British version, just as America had declared itself a separate country from Britain in 1776. Webster wanted to create an American version of written English that was separate from the British version, just as America had declared itself a separate country from, the, from Britain in 1776. Great. As early as 1789, Webster wrote that the new nation should establish a national language as well as a national government. And even before he published his dictionary, he published a spelling textbook used to teach reading and writing. As early as 1789, Webster wrote that the new nation should establish a national language as well as a national government. And even before he published his dictionary, he published the spring textbook used to teach reading and writing. Mm -hmm. 
Webster argued that Americans should simplify their spelling by doing things like removing silent and double letters or changing a soft C to an S, making defense into defense, for example. Webster argued that Americans should simplify their spelling by doing things like removing silent and double letters or changing a soft C to an S, making defense into defense, for example. He believed this would make American English easier to learn and encourage standardized speech and spelling. He believed this would make American English easier to learn and encourage standardized speech and spelling. It would also help American publishers because every British book would have to be reprinted for American readers and British textbooks could no longer be used for schools. In schools. Mm. It would also help American publishers because they every British book would be would have to be reprinted for American readers and British text books could no longer be used in schools. Hmm. Not all of Webster's changes stuck. He wanted to spell soup as soup, for example, and change women to women, but enough were adopted that Webster's effect on American English can still be seen today, and Merriam-Webster dictionaries still carry his name. Not all the Webster's changes stuck. He wanted to spell soup or soup, for example, and change women to women. But enough were adopted that Webster's effect on American English can still be seen today. And Miriam Webster dictionary still carried his name. Great. Mm. So discussion. No. What did you know about the differences between British and American spelling before reading this article? Okay, instead of the thing mentioned in this article, I know the difference of the spelling of theater, E R O R E, and, uh, and pronunciation like water and water, things like that. Mm -hmm. mm. I think the British pronunciation is more strong mm -hmm. accent. Yeah. I mean, yeah. Have you ever been to any other country? Uh, for just uh, uh, holidays, mm -hmm. only for a few days. Yeah, I went to uh, as a unit, the US, Canada, and Switzerland, and other Asian countries like Malaysia, Thailand. Mm. And um, alone or with family? Uh, with my friends. Ah, okay. Mm -hmm. And uh, all these trips were in the past 10 years? Yes. Okay. Mm. Do you think, uh, do you prefer British or American spelling? Um, I prefer American spelling because we taught uh, by American English at school. Uh -huh. mm. So in your university also, the courses, the master's programs are in English or Japanese? Uh, we have only in Japanese courses. All the university is full Japanese. Yes, because as I said, there's only five foreign students and the others are all Japanese. Okay. And mm. the five foreign students can speak Japanese? Yeah, I think so because uh, the criteria to enter the class is that they have the high uh, skill of Japanese. Wow. So yeah, they can speak in English well, <laughs> uh, in Japanese very well. <laughs> I only know sayonara. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Konnichiwa, sayonara. <laughs> right. So, mm. do you find spelling more difficult in English than your language? Spring, spring or spelling, Japanese? Like, yeah, right yeah I think mm. yeah, it's much more difficult than English because we have hiragana, katakana, kanji, mm -hmm. three way of writing letters. So. If I were a foreigner, I may not choose to learn Japanese. Wow. So yeah. the three types of writing, can you name them again? 
。で、ね、ひらがな。ひらがな、うん。カタカナ。カタカナ、うん。And 漢字。漢字。漢字うん、okay。What dictionary do you use? Let me replace this question with、uh, How did you learn English? How did I learn English?、Um, yeah, I, I just studied at school from junior high to university. My,、mm. major, was, my major at university was in American literature.、Mm. So, yeah, I studied English. And、uh, after graduation, I also k e e p studying speaking English, like face to face. A Kaiwa school or DMM A Kaiwa like this online classes. I see.、Mm. And where are your parents? I'm sorry? Where are your parents? Appearance?、Uh, parents? parents, mother, father, mama, papa. Ah,、uh, parents.、Uh, my parents are also from Hokkaido.、Ah, okay.、Mm. So, further discussion.、Okay. How many languages? Your Japan has?、Uh, Japan has、uh, only one language, Japanese.、Mm. Mm. And how many languages do you know?、English? How many languages? Yeah, you can only speak English and Japanese?、Uh, okay, uh, Japanese, English. I, I also studied Chinese at university,、mm. only, but only for two years, so I almost forgot.、Mm. And、uh, yeah. I have a. I'd like to study German someday. Yeah. Because, yeah, when I went to the Switzerland, the, most of the area is spoken in German.、Mm. So, yeah, it was fun to speak in the local language <laughs> to go to the Switzerland again. And I don't know why German sounds to me very cool. <laughs> I don't know why.、Mm. And spring is also cool. And also. In German, they say that the words are long. Yes. And this is, if you want to see, this is Russian.、Mm-hmm. Okay. What, what's that? <laughs> It's, the first letter is K. Yeah. Next is E.、Mm-hmm. Next is T. Yeah. So this, after T, this is Ch. Ch.、Mm-hmm. And Y is U, U. And the last one is P, P, parrot.、Huh. Wow. Ketchup. Ke- ketchup?、Uh, ketchup? Yes. Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> I can't imagine <laughs> from <Yes> . these letters. <laughs> this is ketchup. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. So this is Russian.、Yeah. <laughs> wow. Oh, so how, oh uh, how, how do you learn to speak in R- Russian? I have been living here for more than two years now. Okay. And、uh, I took a small course in Russian language, a very small course, because I, I, now I can just speak little and I can、no. read. Okay. Wow. Yeah. Yeah, the Russian letters look like some are、uh, like. English alphabet, yeah, but yeah. some are very different, like you, you showed me. <laughs> yeah, and、mm. you know, the writing style in English it's capital letters and small letters,、mm. yes,、mm. yes, in Russian also. And if my name is Samid, like S A M double E D, D, D、mm. for dog, but if、yeah. I write Samid in Russian small letters, the D becomes G. Well, so it's sometimes opposite. Okay. And you know, in Russian, the, the word B, B for b o w e l B is not B, B is V. <gasps> yes, B is V. And、uh, I can give you like two, three more examples like this in Russia. Yes, I can give you more examples. Suppose.、Mm-hmm. This,、um, can you see this last、uh, N? N? Yes, yeah. This is not N, this is I. <laughs> <laughs> so,、uh, and H, H, H is N. Okay. H is H for horse. 
Oh. H is N in Russian. Mm. And this R, can you see R? Yeah. Mm. This R is... Mm. Ya. 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 No R. <laughs> what? <laughs> it, it it's complicating. <laughs> Yeah, so grammar is the uh, same like English grammar? No? Well, yeah, they have, for girl, they use Anna, they, for boys, they use uh, on, on, Anna, like this. They have mm. different uh. words and, uh, but, uh, yeah, it takes time to learn Russian, but it's yes. not difficult, not difficult, I tell you. Okay. Russian, Russian, yeah. <laughs> it's I think one of the closest country from Japan, Russia is. But um, I never had a thought to run Russian before. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, mm, what I can ask you? Do you? I mean, do you cook food at home, or do you eat yeah. from outside? Uh, oh, I, I could get home, yes. Mm. Okay. Mm. And what time you go to university? What time you come back to home? Okay, I leave home around uh, maybe 7.30, wow. very early. Yes, and uh, come back to home about maybe 6.30. Mm. Ah, okay, nice. And uh, what is your plan of Sunday? Like today is Sunday? Today is Sunday. Oh, actually, I don't have any plans for today. But uh, yeah, it's sunny outside, so I may go out hmm. after class. Mm. And uh, where would you go in your next vacation? For next vacation, mm, I I would like to go a uh, foreign countries. But uh, yeah, as you know, so it is very weak recently, so I can't do that. So hmm. I may go somewhere in Japan for enjoy hot spring mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Nice. Mm. Cool. so uh, what is your hobby other than work <laughs> okay my one of my hobby is watching pro wrestling matches what matches pro wrestling like ah. WWE uh -huh. yeah 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 I know mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. yeah it's really exciting it what do you know about Pakistan? Pakistan, it's close to India. Yeah. Yes. On, and, only, and I'm sorry, I don't know about Pakistan so much. Okay, so I am sharing one video with you. Mm -hmm. This 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 YouTuber has traveled every country in the world. Oh wow! And he makes videos about countries. So he made this video and uh, just three minutes i guess you can watch it and you will learn about pakistani culture okay and uh, if you want to double check his claim if you want to double check like he, what he's saying is true or not true mm -hmm. you can write this in youtube and there will be a lot of other videos okay it will just increase your knowledge about cultures okay so, uh, mm. yeah mm. Uh, um, mm. like what la last question um, okay. what is happiness for you happiness happiness oh, it's a very difficult question okay um yeah i have a home and <laughs> with my family uh -huh. and uh, yeah have enough income uh -huh. and stay safe mm -hmm. yeah i think it's the happiness great yeah good mm -hmm. answer <laughs> <laughs> i think everybody thinks the same thing yeah. no <laughs> oh, how about you what is the happiness for you well my happiness is hmm. behavior okay behavior Beha means kindness mm -hmm. and just like that like 
like a smile, you know, behavior, mm -hmm. kindness, mm -hmm. like this. That mm -hmm. is happiness for me. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Great. Because money come and money go. Family, yeah, yeah. family come and family can go because everyone will die someday. Ah, uh, right. This kindness is your personal belonging. Mm -hmm. And it can stay with right. you. Ah, yeah. oh, great. great idea. Thank you, Yoko. Thank you. <laughs> Pleasure <laughs> talking to you, and uh, I hope to see mm. you soon. Yes. Sayonara. Sayonara. Bye. Bye. -bye.